Okay, everybody. Um, I had somebody asked if I benched the 1100T, uh, which is going to be the six core processor, which is really one of AMD's strong six cores, so true six cores. And what I'm going to do is we can run, I, I have a bunch of tests that already run on it, but I'm going to just go ahead and run a um, Cinebench on it. Also, this is clocked at 4.1 is where it's clocked. I've had it to 4.2. I had it at 4.2. The only thing I've done on this is um, increase the multiplier and the voltage, and that is it. I didn't play with the front side bus, which is something you can do with uh, this processor. Also, the north bridge, you can increase the voltage, you can massage it. So I know I can massage it to 4.2. I had it run one test at 4.2, and I'll post that. But after that, I started um, getting some blue screens, and um, it's just I'm busy right now, so I can't can't really... I don't know. It's you're not going to see a big difference from four one to four two, and I'll show you that. So you can also Google it. A lot of people have hit four two with this. Generally, four two to four four is where you run with the eleven hundred T. So, but this way it'll at least give you an idea what it ran, and you can actually see it run. And right there, you've got a seven twenty eight, and that's running at four point one. That was a pretty good score. Okay. Okay, here are the results uh, for the overclocking. This is uh, the Phenom, the 1100T. That'll be highlighted in blue. And then, of course, the FX8150 on the right-hand side. That'll be highlighted in green. Um, you can see at stock at 3.3, it runs a 5.86. Then the FX at 3.6 ran a 602. And you can sort of get an idea all the way down. Um, of course, the FX, the new um, FX series chips, they all overclock very well. Um, they just don't perform um, like I believe they should. And as you look at test results, and if you Google it or YouTube it, you're going to find that out as, as time goes on. Um, but anyway, the Phenom 1100T did really, really well. And other than that, I didn't run any, I ran some tests on the 1100T with that same 460, just the one gig card that I've been running for um, for the different tests. The 3D Mark 06 score, you can see them there. And I didn't have anything up for the any of the FX chips um, when it came to any kind of uh, 3D Marks, uh, just because they really they really don't do that well. And um, so I didn't post them at all. But there you go. And if you have any questions, just post them.